Hey everyone, I'm Gunnix here and welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel. So today I wanted to talk about Halo Infinite once again, but this time specifically I wanted to talk more about uh, people saying that Halo Infinite is trying to be Call of Duty, or it is like Call of Duty. Now, I don't know why people think that. I mean, I'm going to try guess in this video, but still, I think it's just a very... Uh, I don't know what word I should use to describe it. It's just a very bad take, I think, on Halo Infinite. I mean, why is the game like Call of Duty? What, because they're sprinting? I mean, yeah, previous Halo games have sprinting as well. So why aren't they like Call of Duty? I mean, honestly, I don't really understand why they're trying to say the game's like Call of Duty. Like, all I can think of is sprinting and sliding. That's, that's literally the only reason I can think of anyone saying it's Call of Duty. But uh, another thing I've seen people say as well is that the Halo Infinite maps are like Call of Duty maps, that they apparently look exactly like Call of Duty maps. Now, here's some Halo Infinite uh, technical preview footage here that I've got, right? And, yeah, they're basically trying to say that the three maps that were available on the technical preview look like Call of Duty maps. Now, tell me, guys, does this look like a Call of Duty map to you? If anything, right, this map, Bazaar, reminds me of Metropolis or Outskirts from Halo 2, if anything. Because I'm pretty sure that's where this map is meant to be based. It's meant to be based in New Mombasa, or just an old part of Mombasa, something like that. So yeah, this is meant to be a Halo 2-esque thing, and that's the vibes I got from it. But no, you have people trying to say, like, oh, it looks like a Call of Duty map, and stuff like that. And uh, even the map Live Fire as well, and Recharge, people are trying to say are like Call of Duty maps. Like, here's what all the maps remind me of, right? So, Bazaar reminds me of, like, a Halo 2 map. Recharge reminds me of something from Halo 5. And then Live Fire, that reminds me of something from, like, say, like, Halo Reach. It's very Halo Reach-esque, sort of. And yeah, those are sort of the free games that those maps remind me of. And, uh, yeah, I don't know where people get Call of Duty from. It sounds like, to me, the people who are saying these things just haven't played Halo, either that or they're just very new to the game, or they've just been playing the last few years or something. Because, I mean, I've been playing Halo, like, almost my whole life, right? I mean, I'm 17 now, I've been playing it since I was very young, and, uh, so I know what the Halo games are like, and Halo Infinite, to me, feels like a good blend of classic and new Halo games, you know? And you can play however you want as well. You can play classically if you want, which uh, in this gameplay you're seeing right now, I'm probably playing very classically, not sprinting at all, which is uh, mainly what I did start doing a few days into the beta. I just stopped sprinting around, and uh, only when I felt like sliding I would start sprinting, since that's, only, since that's the only time you really do need to sprint, since sprinting doesn't really add too much extra movement. I think it adds like maybe a maybe an input an in-between percentage of 2 to 5% speed, maybe, something like that. But yeah, I mean, in Halo Infinite, you can you can play like a classic player if you want, or you could just use everything the game has to its advantage. The game, in my opinion, is just not like Call of Duty. I mean, I've played the Call of Duty games as well before, even the latest ones, and they do not feel like Halo Infinite, like, at all. So I don't know why people are trying to say that Halo Infinite is like Call of Duty. Like, literally, probably just because of the sprinting and sliding, that's it. But I mean, even Halo 5 had sprinting and sliding. And people are trying to say that Halo Infinite's also trying to look like Call of Duty as well. Uh, don't know how people think that. I mean, it looks pretty Halo to me, if you ask me. And it's not like it's a lot of people saying this either. You know, like, it's probably just a small amount of people saying it. But still, even that small amount of people, right, when you go through any Halo Infinite technical preview comment section, you're always going to see a few comments saying that the game is just Call of Duty or looks like Call of Duty. And if you're on Twitter yourself and, you've, and if you've been looking through comments on, like, Halo Infinite technical preview related posts, you most likely know what I mean. Even in YouTube comment sections, you have people saying that the game's like Call of Duty. But yeah, honestly, I just, I just think it's strange how... You could think Halo Infinite is like Call of Duty. And I just wanted to make a quick video today sort of discussing it and giving my thoughts on it. You know, in my opinion, Halo Infinite, uh, from what we've seen in the technical preview and campaign trailers and stuff, 
is going to be a very good blend of classic and new Halo. I mean, just look at all the armor designs, for example. Look at Chief's armor design. It is a good blend of classic and new there. And yeah, overall, uh, I'm excited for Halo Infinite. And whilst everyone's okay to have their own opinion on the game, right? Uh, I still don't understand people saying that, you know, the game is like Call of Duty. And how it looks like Call of Duty. Because, I mean, in that case, uh, wouldn't any first-person shooter really look like Call of Duty? I mean, look at Battlefield. That looks more like Call of Duty than Halo does. I mean, you could realistically say that any first-person shooter is trying to be any first-person shooter, since every first-person shooter sort of has a similar look to one another. Alright, so anyways guys, that is the end of this video. What did you all think, and uh, have you been seeing people say that the game's like Call of Duty as well? And uh, if so, be sure to tell me what you think down in the comments below. Do you think the game's like Halo, or do you think it's like Call of Duty? In my opinion, it's perfect. It's a great Halo game feels like Halo. Hopefully uh, those feelings do continue in future technical previews or betas or the full game in general. But yeah, so anyways guys, that is the end of this video. If you did enjoy, be sure to like, comment and subscribe for more. Also don't forget to share it around so it gets to more people. And yeah, speak to you all soon. Bye-bye.